Hey guys, Robert Baton, Adult Fitness and Holistic Wellness, and today I'm going to talk about how to get that maximum tricep engagement from your work set workout, which means hitting each one of the three heads. So this is my arrow tip of the week. So first I want to talk about the anatomy of the tricep. Now the tricep, the tricep um, uh, muscle is mainly fast twitch fibers, which means it responds better to heavy weights and more powerful action, quicker action, okay? Now, obviously, it's not one size fits all with training, and research has shown that people have a, a, a great variance in joint angles and also in attachment points, especially in the tricep muscle itself, okay? But that being said, this is how the tricep works. Its main job is to extend the elbow, all right? Now, you've got three parts to the tricep, three heads. You've got the lateral head, on the outside here, you've got the lung head, which is the bulky bit at the back of the arm, which gives the size of the arm, more important the bicep, remember that. And then you've got the medial head, which is right underneath here, it's deep underneath the lung head. Okay, you probably if I had no skin on, you could probably just about to the end of the medial head here, okay. Now, the um, lateral head and the lung head, sorry, the lateral head and the medial head, sorry, both attached to the top of the arm here and then connected over the elbow. So their job is only to extend the elbow, the lung head attaches on the, on the forearm, but also comes all the way back here and attaches onto the shoulder blade, um, known as the scapula. So it's got another job as well, which is to bring the arm towards the body. So that being said, how do we target each of the three heads? Now, if I'm trying to target the lateral head um, of the tricep, then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do something with my hand. Okay, so I need to turn my hand over into this kind of in this kind of movement and that's going to target the lateral head more head more now that's known as pronated grip so that involves any exercise where I'm pushing down like this so a cable rope um, push downs tricep push downs a great example because as you're coming down that little push down that, that that turning over the hand at the bottom is what's really going to target the lateral head if I'm trying to target the medial head right under here right deep inside which is going to pad the lung head out then I need to have my hand this way so that means having my hand face up towards the ceiling and doing this kind of action. So any exercise that replicates that, okay? Um, it's, it's various, a, 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 a tricep, pull, a, a tricep um, pull down with the hand facing like that would be a good example. Now, the lung head's slightly different. And the lung head is what gives that size to the arm. Okay, so it's really important you hit this properly as well. And it's worth knowing, like I said, that it connects to a different part of the body. So what we need to do is, we need to put that muscle in a stretch position when we extend the elbow. Now, this can be done by doing um, bench, reverse grip bench press, or any, any kind of bench is gonna have it in that position anyway. But what also targets it, my favorite one, is a skull crusher. Because when we're doing a skull crusher, imagine I'm lying on my back. Obviously, I'm extending the arm, I'm putting this tricep in a stretch position, then, when I do this action, it's going to target in that way, alright? Now a pro tip here for you guys, when you're doing a skull crusher, instead of having it above your head, have it slightly back in and put it more of a stretch position. Another way I like to target is, is to basically pre-exhaust it before I start doing my, the bulk of my workout. And you can do this one of two ways, or one of many. My favourite two ways are, A, using a tricep kickback. Now everyone knows, you can't really build quality muscle doing a tricep kickback. If you think you can, then you're mistaken, because your wrist takes all the onus and putting a big weight in your hand. You start to lose grip before you really target the tricep. What it's good for is developing that mind to muscle connection and really feel the lung head working. Another way to target, and this is my favourite way completely, is to do a straight arm pull down. Now I know straight arm pull down is going to target the lat as well, okay? But what it's going to do if you've got nice and light 15, 20 reps, something like that, to start the workout, it's really going to get loads of blood to this part of your arm, okay? And then you get that mind to muscle connection developed. So yeah, there you have it guys. Arrow Fitness and Holistic Wellness. There's my Arrow Tip of the Week. I'm Robert Baton. Follow me at, at Arrow Fitness on Twitter, no W. Um, go to my website, arrowwellness.com, only one W, or patreon.com forward slash arrowwellness, one W, where I do loads of exclusive content, including a podcast. There's my Arrow Tip of the Week. Now go and get some massive arms, everyone. You know what I mean?